hey guys welcome back to a new video i'm going to be showing you guys my fall day and night time routine i don't do anything special but i did wanted to share with you guys what i typically do during the day and at night but before we get into my routine today's video is in collaboration with the dossier so if you're new to dossier dossier is a brand that provides high quality luxury inspired scents for a fair price they also provide candles and home diffusers for your home your bedroom wherever you want to put it they do provide cologne for men and perfume for women dossier is known for making inspired scents from those bigger brands such as chanel prada gucci the list goes on i do have two scents here that i want to share with you guys i have musky green tea and ambery saffron ambery saffron is a inspired scent for baccarat rouge 540 scent here has a very like grown and like a dress up like getting dressed up kind of scent it smells really good it has a mature scent and then the next scent that i have is musky green tea which is inspired by creed and this is a cologne for men yo this smells so so good you guys want to see me wear it in the video and i highly recommend this scent for your man okay you can find dossier in walmart as well inside the store and on their website so i I will leave everything linked down below. All right, so jumping right into my routine. Today is Sunday. Today is actually a filming day. So I want to go ahead and make me some breakfast. Something really quick. I'm going to be putting some cinnamon toast in the oven. And then I'm going to make me a quick, small little fruit bowl. I got some strawberries, grapes, and blueberries i did wash my fruit off camera so i'm just going to go ahead and put that into a bowl and wait until my toast gets ready So I'm just going to sit here and eat my breakfast and after I eat my breakfast I'm going to go ahead and get ready to film y'all that cinnamon toast with apple jelly was so good y'all I could not believe it I usually I've tried it with like grape jelly but the apple jelly just was hitting I love apple jelly it it tastes so good if you haven't eaten apple jelly I don't know what's wrong with you okay I'm trying to give you a bite here here One thing I can't stand doing is making dish water. I, I just can't. I just, I prefer to let the water run. I know that's wasteful, but I just feel like it makes me move faster. Like it just, I, I just can't. Okay. I just need the water to be running um, while I'm washing dishes, especially if it's like five dishes in the sink. I'm not, no, I'm not making no dish water, but I'm just going to go ahead and clean out my spooky mugs that I got. Um, you guys seen this one and then I got this one from Walgreens. I didn't show you guys this one, but yeah, I was just washing out the dishes that were in the sink and just kind of tidy up a little bit, but mm -mm, girl, I'll be making no dish water. If it's a lot of dishes, I will make some. So yeah, right now I'm just, this is what I do. So I either watch snap on Sundays or since it's spooky season, I usually um, I'm watching something spooky, of course. So right now, I'm going to go ahead and get ready to wash my face and brush my teeth. I want to hurry up and use this Innisfree face wash. I do like it. I love the way it foams up. It's just taking forever to use it. I feel like it's so much product in the tube. Like I'm just ready to be done and move on to other products in my collection. Like I, I just, I'm just done with it. Thank you. 
girl, and not me setting up the camera, walking into my room and acting like I don't see y'all. But yeah, listen, my skincare collection, not skincare collection, but my skincare routine in the morning is very simple. Face wash, toner, and moisturizer. I use the Clinique hydrating jelly i like that for my oily skin so right now i'm just gonna go ahead and prep for my video you guys have already seen this video the beauty supply store like fall makeup glam kind of video so i'm just prepping this is what i do when i usually do like a makeup tutorial i prep everything so i don't have to get up because that's that is so annoying when you're doing a makeup video and you got to get up and get stuff so I try to like lay everything out before I get started. And then as you guys can see right here, I already did the video. I couldn't wait to take those eyelashes off. And I'm gonna go ahead and use my Clinique, take the day off and take off my makeup. So it has been a few hours later. I am going to take my shower for the night. I'm going to be using my Dove soap and my Bath and Body Works cozy evening and midnight spell. And here we go with the Innis Free again. Girl, I am trying to use this up, honey. So for my nighttime routine, I'm going in with the same toner, some eye cream from Tony Moly. Trying to use that up as well. Trying to use this up. This urban. Girl, I'm moving so fast. But y'all see what I'm doing. Spray, spray, spray. And then I love this stuff. I'm almost done with this. This will be in my empties. And then this is the lotion that I'm going to be using. The Noir. Love this stuff. And then y'all, look at my PJs. I did haul these to you guys from Burlington. These are super, super cute. And it comes with a little hair tie. Like, listen. I was giving pumpkin realness, okay? Pumpkin patch realness. This was so, 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 so cute. So, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and put my hair in a bun. And I'm going to go ahead and put on the Dossier Musky Green Tea. And I'm going to go ahead and spray that on me. Um, and, yeah, and then after that, I'm going to go in the kitchen, give me some water because your girl was thirsty. I was real thirsty and I forgot to show you guys like give you guys in full body of my cute pajamas. I'm trying to show y'all my ruffles on my pants, but they're super, super cute. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and what? Well, not the peach, not the booty. So it has been a few days later and I just got off of work. And one thing that I like to do at night when I get off of work is usually like around five or six something. I like to go to Ross and Marshalls and Target, but today we only did Ross and Marshalls. I don't go every day, maybe once a week or every two weeks. And immediately when I walked in, I seen these Steve Madden bags. Y'all know I got one. I definitely got that black one. And I really did like the other one. That was a really nice color. But then I seen these Steve Madden bags. I wanted one, but I saw the $50. I was like, now, wait a minute. I had to make some decisions. But hopefully I can find one because I did like the clear bag and I like the strap. So they had a lot of them. And girl, I found this brown cognac bag. So that was my favorite find. And then I also found this Steve Madden bag. This was giving me Christmas party, like office Christmas party vibes. So I put that back. And they had these cute little Betsy Johnson bags. And I thought they were cute, but I didn't get one. I kind of wanted this DKNY bag, but I didn't get it. I was looking for that Betsy Johnson tote bag. No luck. Y'all, I found a cranberry. Literally, one of you all commented on my Ota haul and said they were coming up in Marshalls and TJ Maxx. And I found one. 
so I'm just basically looking around I found some really really cute Hello Kitty stuff but I changed my mind at the register and I didn't get none of the Hello Kitty stuff and I found this Nightmare Before Christmas duffel bag I really wanted this And then I went next door to Ross. Y'all, I was so happy when I found these pictures, but I did not get it because I've been on a hunt for these pictures. But those are not the ones that I wanted, so I'm going to hold out. And I'm just looking at the makeup organizers. They really didn't have too much in this Ross. So after I left Ross, I just came home and I remembered that my aunt made some cookie pudding this is basically banana pudding without the bananas i'm not a big fan of banana pudding like i would eat it but i don't have to eat it like i don't really touch banana pudding like that but my aunt started making cookie pudding without the bananas and i prefer that anyway to me it still tastes like banana pudding but it's not so banana-y so I prefer the cookie pudding so I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here I'm gonna go in my room and finish binge watching Martin I'm probably gonna watch maybe one or two episodes but I'm gonna end the video here I hope you guys are enjoying Vlogtober so far I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys want me to do more videos like this but this is what I typically do I'm boring y'all I don't do much so I can do more videos like this if you guys want so I hope you guys enjoy if you guys are new here make sure you guys subscribe and I'll talk to you guys later about that little waterhead brother used to go out with? Come on, ease up on him.